no plans, no plans at all Evil man's always transcending Fight her like sheep, swallow everything Always simple tins or pretending We got no plans This is your moment of clarity from LeeCamp.net Everyone is acting like Todd Akin's statements about quote-unquote legitimate rape are outlandish. But in fact, it makes perfect sense, and that's why Paul Ryan, vice presidential candidate and man who bases his entire life on fictional books like Atlas Shrugged, The Bible, and The Bible 2, Attack of the Clones, agreed with the idea that there are different kinds of rape. You see, Ryan even co-sponsored abortion legislation with Todd Akin that changed the terminology from just rape to forcible rape. And again, this makes perfect sense because there's forcible rape, then there are other lesser rapes like accidental rape when you slip and fall, and hand rape when a guy's alone and he has his way with his hand, or there's steeple rape where you have to jump hurdles, or rape on ice, which is popular at the Winter Olympics, and so many others. No, the truth is these evangelical millionaire facial diarrhea phenoms want to act like rape doesn't exist because it fucks up their pro-life stance. They know it's not morally justifiable to demand a woman carry a baby to term when that baby is the unwanted result of a terrible and traumatic event in her life. So rather than accept the fact that even in their fucked up anti-choice world, there are exceptions, they've chosen to redefine rape. And these ass clowns claim to be pro-life. They claim to care about every little thing, every bundle of cells as a human being we should care for and hug and kiss and protect, except in cases of rape except for live adult women. Well, hold on just one second. Was it a legitimate rape or a courtesy rape? Or a gift rape? Or a practice rape? Let's not jump to the conclusion it was a real legitimate rape. That's your moment of clarity from LeeCamp.net. It was shorter than usual because sometimes things are so insane they only take a minute to clear up. If you're still hungry for more footage of me trashing right-wing nut jobs, click here to watch me take on Tea Party Queen Sharon Angle, who famously said that a woman who has gotten pregnant from a rape should have the baby in order to make lemonade from lemons. Oh, that's so sweet. You know, the sensitivity never begins with these people. Plans, no plans at all. Evil man's always transcending. Fight her like sheep, swallow everything. Always simple tins or pretending.